Watch this. Uh, I keep this because uh, Spellstone is a card, right? Maybe keep this because Yashira is a card. Uh, does Lock and Load Hunter still do well? That would suggest that it did well ever. So I can't answer that question. All right, we hang on to this because it's our activator. I don't know why I kept the Fire Tree Witch Doctor. It seems like a bad keep. I'm just interested to see if the card is any good, to be honest with you. Okay, so this is not going to hit a Yashira, but that's okay. Spirit Lash. Ooh. Ooh, these are bad. <laughs> uh, ugh. I guess it's Embrace. I don't really have a great way of... No, that was a... I mean, I only have the hero power as healing. You can put Lock and Load and Spell Hunter. Yeah, and then you have a card that does nothing for uh, most of the game. So, I mean, you could... I mean, it was okay, but it, it's always been, um, it's always been mostly just a meme. Look at this, and you guys said that Embrace the Shadow was bad, and I should be, feel bad. Nobody actually said that. Okay, so I'm assuming our opponent isn't going to have spellstones. Probably good. But well, that's just a cute little cat. Like, why does it have to go all crazy? I think I want this more than I want the taunt right now. I've got the AOE for the clear. Blanking Strike is a good card. I'm thinking he's not going to be running pirates because there aren't any beast pirates, so uh, Flanking Strike is good. Acolyte was definitely better there. Yeah, but I wanted to get rid of the dead card. Duskbreaker is a good card. I'm counting on uh, stealing a Savannah High Main with this. No, I know what turn you're talking about. I just. Kill that. Draw a card. Heal or play a whelp? I think we play a whelp. Uh, I kind of want to get this down next turn, so that's uh, and I want to hang on to the dragon, so I'm just gonna heal. Here's our high main. Just need to find a potion of madness. I can just entomb that instead. That's mine now. I think Rexar is our only concern. That's also a bit concerning. But I can kill that, right? Especially with trades here. Can definitely kill that. I'd say we're in a good spot here. Overlay is still Hunter. You're right. What is wrong with the uh, deck tracker? I'm just going to close it out and reopen. Because it's being dumb. Alright, so our opponent drew the card. It's a bit of a bummer. Now I can't steal it with the operative. 
This does more damage, and I think I'm just smorking him from here. I want to hang on to this because it's my only dragon. Well, we've got a death for that, uh, or if I... Wow. I think death is just fine, so I can keep going face. Uh, actually, if I draw... Or no, I have the dragon, so I could just... Um, just do this. Attack, and heal. I don't think there's any reason to play this. Or the, uh, the whelp when it's my only dragon. Well, that's your big boy. That's unfortunate. It's also unfortunate. But... I can kill that. Uh, let's see what dragon we get first, though. Hog champ. That's always going to have to happen. And we just play this. It seems like a good card that he made for us, so I'll copy it. One mana 4-4 four, four with Rush. Got 17 on board, uh, no Anduin in sight, but uh, we can just keep grinding away. Got a nice reset button here, board clear here. Okay, so we're going to make good use of this Lynx. Somehow we're outvaluing Rexar right now. It could help that we have the triple Dragonid operative. That's not a beast. Ugh. Oh. So much lifesteal. Stupid Rexar. I think I just want to cycle into more stuffs. That's a stuff. I could trade into the beast, but this is his last Razor Maw, right? So yeah, let's go and face. Nice order. Nice face. Got him. Wait, it actually was correct order. What are you talking about? I did all the dry things first. I think Meowth meant opponent. Playing Razor Mob before Zombies. Oh. Oh god, that was abysmal. What if he got Divine Shield? Yeah. I mean... Kinda sucks. Uh, Anduin is lethal, though. You can just death it as well. Or entomb it. <laughs> I think I want that. Let's see you work your way out of this one, Rexar. Uh... No, I don't have to wish I had the Entomb anymore, Jellycat. It's there. It's there. <laughs> I just knew I was going to top deck it, so why would I be worried? Stop it! I 
mean, I've got two of these, so it's just fine. The alternative was like a uh, death uh, excavated turn that didn't fully clear the board, which I'm not too keen on. This is quite large. This also helps ensure lethal. Hey, giant hedgehog. Welcome. It's going well. We are uh, grinding away at this uh, Deathstalker Rexar and making some good progress. Our opponent is at one health point. Came here from YouTube? Nice, nice. I'm glad, uh, I'm glad you found your way to a live stream. Uh, could we be dead to, like, a an Unleash the Hounds? So he gets plus 6, 12, right? Because 6 die, 12, plus a potential zombie is 14. No, we're not dead to it. I think I shield one of these. Oh, hey, this can find us lethal if we get another dragon. Yeah, I counted it. I just wanted to be sure. So it's 14 plus 16. He'd be one off. So with, theoretically, we could be dead with like a kill command. Like unleash kill command is lethal. But there are two zombies in hand, so I'm not really going to play around that when I've already seen one kill command and one unleash the hounds. And I just need a board presence to uh, to close that out. Thank you.